Hello, I'm absolutely delighted to welcome back Tara Kelly, the mortgage manager at the mortgage shop here in Waterford. Welcome, Tara. Thank you, Regina. Now, as an estate agent, Tara, we prefer to do viewings with prospective buyers who are purchase ready. In other words, that they've already got their mortgage approval. What advice would you give to somebody um, when they're going to get their mortgage, uh, I suppose, sorted, really? And how soon should they go about this? Well, my advice to anybody who is thinking about getting on the property ladder, go straight away and get your mortgage approved. Because now, once you get approval, it will hold for 12 months. Okay, that's good news. It used to be six months, now it's 12. But you're in a much stronger position when you're bidding for a property if you're actually mortgage ready and you have your mortgage approval in your hand rather than saying to the likes of yourself, I need to go and get my mortgage Totally. Sorted. And I suppose what are the really important tips for someone who needs to get mortgage approved? What do they need to be doing to get their house in order? Well, to get your house in order, you need to be very, very mindful of your bank statements. Your bank statements are the mirror to your day-to-day -day activity and how you're running your own personal budget and to make sure that they're constantly in a credit situation and not to have any referrals, fees or charges on your bank statement that doesn't favour well with a bank. It's a business commitment that you're getting into with the bank, so you need to make the best presentation and proposition to the bank to want them to get into business with you. And if somebody is renting, how should that be reflected on their bank statement? Renting, I see it all the time, Regina, with people that are renting. We need to have a paper trail on the rent. So if somebody is renting, we need to see the rents either coming out of the bank statement or dealing with a reputable renting agency like yourself who can give me a full statement on the rents. If a customer is paying cash to its landlord, I can't prove that to the bank that that's actually happening. Okay. So you need to make sure that your rents are actually being either mandated from the account or we can get And is there anything statement. in relation to jobs or being, I suppose, that regarding your job contract that would impact on your... Well, if you're, if you're self-employed, you need to be able to prove that you're up and running and you can show accounts for three years. And if you're PAYE, you need to be in the one job, the same job, for at least 12 months. Okay, 12 months. That's great advice. And just how far in advance can somebody go and see a mortgage broker like yourself, Tara? Oh, as soon as they decide to get on the property ladder. So it's never too early? Never too early. Okay, super. That's great advice, Tara. Thank you very much. As I usually say, I'll be back.